New details tonight about a Grayson County man shot and killed by Elizabethtown police. This is not the first time Joshua Blaw has had a violent altercation with officers. Mark Vanderhoff is here now with what he's learned about him. Mark? Rick, Vicki, Joshua Blaw was also shot by a Kentucky state trooper in 2012. In that case, they were responding to a burglary in progress. I'm not for sure if it was a husband, wife, boyfriend, girlfriend, but uh, anyhow, a lady stating that a um, gentleman had gotten out of the car and she was concerned uh, about this individual. That's how Elizabethtown police described Tuesday night's call to police. Officers Scott Richardson and Matt McMillan responded. They say Joshua Blah was armed with a knife and refused to drop it. They say he started to come towards them. That's when they fired. A neighbor corroborated that story. And when the man came towards them, I saw one of the policemen pull out his gun. Blah was also shot by a Kentucky State Police trooper in 2012. Troopers were responding to a burglary in progress when they encountered Blah. He was at this home on South Wilson Road, about 10 minutes from where he was shot Monday. In both cases, police say Blah refused to comply with commands. Not only did he refuse to comply, he started milling around in the back of his truck. In that incident, police say he pulled a gun out of his truck. A trooper fired once and hit Blah in the neck. If we feel our life is in danger of a serious, serious injury or death, then we, we have to take action, and that's exactly what he did. He now, after that first shooting, Blah was sentenced to 30 days in prison for menacing. He served it at the same time as a three year sentence for a Grayson County burglary. Blah was released from prison 14 months early. Mark Vanderhoff, WLKY News. Thank you, Mark. Officers McMillan and uh, Scott Richardson are both on administrative leave now while state police investigate the shooting. McMillan has been with E Town Police for the past eight years. Richardson is a 13 year old.